Hello everybody, let's go with the lab. We are going to take a look to EIGRP configuration on GNS3 together. Alright, we have four steps to accomplish. In the first step, we need to configure the network above with EIGRP using autonomous system number 50. Okay. Additionally, EIGRP should not work as a classful routing protocol, which means I need to use no auto. I need to close auto summarization, that means. All right. Then in the second step, EIGRP neighborhood should not be established on any interface if there are no EIGRP routers. That means use passive interface somewhere i'm gonna show you where all right in the third bb router should summarize networks between 00 and 7255 as a single network the loopbacks as you can see there and in the fourth, we BB router should use unequal load balance to reach 10120 slash 24 network. And this is here. BB router gonna reach there via using unequal load balance. I'm gonna show you how. All right, let's start with the first thing. We need to configure the network above with using EIGRP autonomous system 50. All right, guys, I'm gonna advertise this network and this network as a single statement on BB router by using 10100, okay? And I'm gonna advertise the loopbacks by using 172.30.00. All right. Then I'm gonna do a different thing and I'm gonna just use the interface IP addresses for router two and router three to advertise them into EIGRP. All right, let's start with the BB router. I'm going to router one, which is BB. Okay, close that thing. All right, let's go with the BB router. Conf T, router EIGRP 50. All right. What question wants me from is to close the auto summary. First, I need to use no auto. Then I'm gonna advertise the networks, but first what I'm offering to you is just take a look to the interface by using show IP interface brief command. Interfaces are looking properly configured that, and I'm gonna now advertise them, all right? Network 10100 and with a wildcard mask of 00255255, which, which means every network beginning with 10 to 1. Okay. Then I'm going to advertise the loopbacks. 30.0. And 255, 255. All right, I finished the BB and I'm gonna reach to do rather two and rather three right now. Show IP interface brief. I'm just gonna hit the interface IP addresses this time by using a 0000 wildcard mask. Okay. Router EIGRP 50 and no auto again. Then 0000 24 and 
25. All right, we have a new ad GCNC. I'm going to check it later. Okay, let's go ahead with the router tree and show IP interface brief. 10, 1, 2, 3, and 34.2. Okay. Router EIGRP 50. No auto. And I'm hitting the interface IP addresses in here too. That two. Okay, we have woo, we have two adjacencies in here. Here is the good news. And let's check the adjacencies of BB router first. Okay, we have two. This one is rather 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 three actually, and this is rather two. And in rather two unknown neighbors. Okay, three and one. And in here neighbors. They are rather one and three. I'm sorry, rather one and two. Alright. The first step seems to be okay. What I'm gonna configure is now the second step, which says me that EIGRP neighborhood should not be established on any interface if there are no EIGRP routers. Can you see an interface which has no neighbors? Fast 00 of BB has a neighbor in here, which is router 3, and in here he has a neighborship with router 2. Router 2 from Fast 00, it's neighbor of the router 3 over Fast 00 again. But in here we don't have any routers, and that means I don't need to send hello packets from here so I need to close it by using the passive interface command for the fast internet one one on router two all right let's go passive interface fast internet one one Okay, we accomplished this step two. And okay, okay, let's go with the three. BB router should summarize networks between 00 and 7.255 as a single network. Okay, but first, I need to check the Routing table of router 3. So, what I'm seeing about this loopback, guys. I'm on router 3 and typing show IP routes. As you can see in here, I'm seeing all the loopbacks. Alright, now I'm gonna use a route summarization on BB router to summarize this route actually. Summarize the loopbacks. On BB router, we have two interfaces FAST00 and FAST10. I'm gonna use the summary address for both this and this interfaces. If I just summarize in here, it will be summarized on rather trees routing table, but it won't be summarized on router 2. So to both summarize it, I'm gonna use fast Ethernet 10 and I'm gonna use fast Ethernet 00 to summarize. Alright. Let's go to BB. BB, where are you, BB? Okay. 00. Let's check the loopbacks. Alright, this guys, and I'm gonna 
choose a proper IPN subnet mask to summarize. Okay. IP summary address EIGRP 50 30 zero zero with a subnet mask of this guy that covers all the loopbacks okay if you don't believe me please turn back to CCNA and calculate it again all right what I've done is I configured on fast trans zero zero on this interface so let's check what what we are seeing on router 3 and router 2 side I'm on router 3 show a paragraph as you can see that we have a summarized perfect in here so which is 0, .0 0.0 slash 21 all right let's go ahead with the third step BB router should summarize networks between 0, 00 and 7255 as a single network okay to summarize all these loopbacks I'm gonna use zero zero with a subnet mask of oops the zero okay what I'm gonna use is just use the summarization for fast Ethernet zero zero and fast Ethernet one zero of the BB router all right I'm going to router one and IP summary address EIGRP50 that's zero then I'm gonna configure the same thing for one zero all right I'm now summarizing those routes from my fast Ethernet 00 and fast Ethernet 10 ports. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look to the IP routing table of router 3 this time. Show IP route. Okay, what I'm seeing right now is a summary route instead of all routes I just saw from their loopbacks okay let's take a look to router 2 all right I'm receiving a summary route in here too as well okay as you can see in here I'm not receiving all these prefixes and I'm just receiving a slash 24 21 instead of receiving all of these guys separately three accomplished and the last step BB router should use unequal load balance to reach 10 1 2 0 slash you slash 24 network all right what I'm gonna do is in here to configure a variance command to make unequal load balancing on BB router. All right, I'm gonna send two packets from one path, for example, and I'm gonna send one packet when I'm sending two packets from the other path. All right, to configure it on BB router, I'm going this guy again, router EIGRP50, and I'm just configure a variance with the value of two. Okay, this guy was accomplished too.